Hey folks, this is Vincent Benny Jr. with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and once again we're going to play another game of X-Wing. I'll be playing as the Scum Faction again, and he'll be playing as the Rebel Alliance. This is a 75-point game. So without further ado, let's take a quick look at the ships we picked and what upgrade cards go with them. Okay, as far as Vinny's fleet is concerned, he has the YT-2400 piloted by Eden Vril, Outrider title, Mangler Cannon, and Nine Numb. Then over here we've got an X-Wing uh, piloted by Wedge Antilles with the R2-D2 upgrade. All of that comes to 75 points. Okay, as far as my fleet is concerned, I have the Hawk 290 piloted by Caleb Gaudi with an Ion Cannon turret. And then I have two Black Sun Enforcers, which are Star Vipers. All of that comes to 75 points. Okay, before we get started, standard disclaimers, I do not have a professional video camera or recording software, so the lighting and coloring may be off at times. And on top of that, we fly casual, meaning we play to have fun. Uh, don't leave us nasty comments that we played wrong, that we should be banned from the game, and all that jazz. You wouldn't believe the crap that I get. So let's go ahead and move on to the planning phase. Okay, the first round uh, was skipped. Nothing really happened there. We're not in range to really attack. We were barely out of range. Uh, so this is the second round, activation phase, starting with my ones here. And I have a three straight ahead. And for my action, I think I'll take a uh, target lock on Wedge and Tilly's here. And, um, yeah, the next up is this other one. Now, it's the same distance, so I'm just going to move them up like that. Three straight ahead. And three. I'll also take a target lock on Wedge and Tilly's. I'll take a one shot for my three. Which, and I hit you, but you see. Not, I, thought, I thought we were going to hit, but apparently oh. we're at deadly range. Okay, so you get to take an action with him. If I did a barrel, well, it might be out of range. I could do that. What are you going to do? I want to see if I can do a barrel. Roll. Barrel? Roll? Where are you going to go? I don't know. Trying to see if I'm You're trying to get out of range one. Well, you could. Do you want to do that or? I'm still. Well, that. you can remember you can go down here, but the downside is got an asteroid there. It's up to you. I mean, you can I'll do that. you can put it. I might be able to get it out of it. Okay. I'm not close to range. If you think you can escape that asteroid on a future turn, it's it's completely up to you. Your choice. I'll do it, but I won't use a target lock. Uh, well, you already barrel rolled, so. I don't know why I have a target lock. That's me. I have a target lock. Um, next up is my five down here. I'm going three straight ahead. And for my action, I will take a target lock on Wedge. And what, what are you going to do for Wedge? Two straight. Two straight. This is going to get nasty. This is the bottom. All right, and what action would you like to take with him? I think we're going to uh, raise and range of him for a turret lock, just saying. And uh, I'm guessing we're in range here, too. Uh-huh, range one of these guys. I'll take a turret lock, probably. Target lock or focus? Or focus, I guess. It's up to you. If I use a focus, I might be able to use it for defending. Because... Okay. Okay, so ultimately you went with a target lock because of my special ability, uh, which is this guy here. Uh, at the start of the combat phase, you may remove one focus or evade token from an enemy ship at range 1 to 2 and assign it to yourself. Since I was going to take his focus anyway, he went with the target lock. Okay, so um, I think that concludes the activation phase, right? Mm -hmm. And now we'll move on to combat. Uh, what are we going to do uh, first? I think Wedge and Tilly gets yeah, to shoot first. Mine. All right, and who I'm him at range one, one gives or me four attack dice. dice. You right. get two evade. Two, two defense dice, yes. Because of my ability. Mm hmm because of your ability. All right. I'm turn off on you and this one guy. So mm -hmm. Two, number two. So, that's what I want. Focus, focus, focus. It's really good if I took a focus. Well, that, yeah. Yeah, but. Remember, I mean, it's up to I'll you. I'll spend my turn off. Okay. Three hits total. You've got a blank there. So even if you took the focus, you still would have gotten the same. So, alright, so I've got an evade and a focus. Um, so I take two hits. One 
I take, uh, let's see, that's face number down. two, so I take a face down damage card on that Star Viper there. So, yeah, had you taken the focus, you would have gotten, how many focuses did you have? Three of one hit. Oh, so you, you would have actually gotten more with the focus. Yeah, but you would have taken it. Well, yeah, it's true, at the start of the combat phase, yeah. Okay. All right, so, um, next up is this guy here. He's a five, and you're... He, your Outrider's a three. So I'm going to go ahead and use my Ion Cannon at range, or Ion Turret, I should say. There's a difference. Um, I get three attack dice. Three defense for me. All right, so... Um, or two defense. I'm going to go ahead and spend my target lock to re-roll my two focus. Should have taken a focus. Then you wouldn't be able to take that focus. From I've got two me. hits and a blank. I don't think you would have been able to take that focus since... Mm. You've got a focus and a blank, so you do take uh, a hit on your shield. Now, it's an ion, so the way that works is um, you take one hit, but you get an ion token. Had that been a blaster turret, yeah, you would have had him take them both. But now you have an ion. It means I can't... For the next round, you have to go one straight. It's a white maneuver. Um, next up is your three over here. Now, you have a mangler cannon, which is a secondary weapon, so um, that doesn't matter. Yeah, it does. Because of the Outrider. No, what I mean is, it, it, range 1 doesn't matter. With, no, it does. What do you mean it does? It goes 1 to 3. No, 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 no. What I mean is the extra, you don't get an extra attack die for being at range 1 but with a secondary I weapon. Uh, I thought you meant like I wanted to use it. No, you can use it. Yeah, yeah you can use it. I just, you don't get an extra attack die. Had you used your primary weapon here, you could attack oh. me with 4 attack dice, but because you have No, a, I only have 2. Outright. Oh, you only have two. Oh, yeah. my bad. That's the, um... Millennium Falcon. Yeah. I know. Okay, go ahead. Because he has the cold age. Cannon. My memory is, you know, terrible in my old age. Okay, so I can change a crit to a hit. Crit to a hit. Who are you attacking now? This would be number three. Number three. This guy here. How oh. much hull does he have? Who? The, um, two. Two has three hull left. Well, I guess I could attack him. It's up to I you. I guess I'll do number two. Number two, all right. Since he might, because if I can get one less for him, he might not get destroyed. Come on. Uh, focus, focus, crit. So, okay, I just need one of eight here. Three freaking blanks? Wow. Okay, so I take a face-up card. Um, structural damage. Reduce your agility value by one to a minimum of zero. As an action, I can roll one attack die. On a hit result, flip this card face down. So I have one less agility. I wish I had this a focus, because I would have gone three, two crits. That would have been that would have been brutal. But the bearer roll saved you from me attacking. Now I'm forced to attack Wedge. Even though I may not want to. But okay, so now we're on to these guys here. Uh, we are at range one on both. Range two for him. Uh I can, yeah. it, it has all right, range one, this guy, range two, this guy. Okay, so I get four attack dice with this guy here. I have a target lock, so let oh, me yeah, resolve that. I know. All right, um, I'm going to go ahead and spend my target lock to re-roll these blanks that I have. I have three oh, yeah. blanks. I have two agility. I'm probably going to die. I have a hit. Okay, so two hits. One. Okay. okay, so you take one damage. All right, next up is this guy here, range... Two, so three attack dice against Wedge. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a target lock uh, to reroll my blank. And it gives three hits. Alright, so you've got an evade and a focus. So you take two face down damage cards. I mean, you only have one hall left. Alright, one hall left for Wedge. Alright. Okay, so I think that concludes the combat phase. And now we'll move again on to the activation phase. All right, the activation phase, starting with my ones here. Um, I'm going to do a three Segner's loop. For this guy, and that puts a stress on me. You can do a shunt like Mm-hmm. And then this guy is also going to do a three Segner's loop. Probably the other way. Yep. If you did that way, it would probably hit me. Yeah. That puts stress on me. And your three is up next. What are you going to do with that? One hard turn. One hard turn. All white right. Maneuver. It is a white maneuver. It's impressive. Um, yeah, you missed the asteroid, so you're good. 
And uh, what action do you want to take with him? I will take a focus. Focus. Because you're probably at range three. Uh, focus, focus, focus. Oh, they're all right here. Oh, you got it? Okay. Yeah. And um, your... my guy next is going to do a two slight turn. Is it? No. Yeah, two slight turn. Damn dial. Alright, um... Uh, yeah, these things, I, I'm still trying to figure out how to get these to stay on. Like, these buttons keep popping off. Alright. How much hull does that optimum we have? The what now? This guy. He has four hull. I will take a target lock on Wedge and Tilly's. Oh yeah, because the ion cannon won't do much damage against that, since you have to have two ion cannons. Mm -hmm. We have to have two ion cannons on our disable. Yeah, I need an, yeah, I need two ion tokens on a large ship to disable it. Okay, and uh, what am, what's missing? This guy here, he has to move one straight. It's a white maneuver. So, so R2-D2 does not kick in. Um, the ion token goes away, but you still get an action. So what action would you like to take with uh, Wedge, and Wedge and Achilles? I wish he had a base. Okay. okay. Alright, um, so I think that concludes the activation phase, and now we'll move on to the combat phase. Okay, combat phase. I'm going to use my ability. At the start of the combat phase, you may remove one focus or evade token from an enemy ship at range 1 to 2 and assign it to yourself. Um, the only one, actually, I... If you did that, no, that's range 3. It's range 2, buddy. Um, if you remove that I that will that. take the focus away from the out, because he is the biggest threat right now. Alright, and you cannot attack, but you can still defend with that focus. So, you I'm going to take your focus and just, huh? When do you want to knock my defense out? So I want to be able to reborn. Well, I, this guy's going to kill me. Like, you've, you've got some major firepower here. So I'm going to try and declaw him while finishing off Wedge. Okay, um, so now the 9 gets to go. Now, there's no firing solution here. Sure. So then we move on to the 5, which is this guy. I'm going to use my Ion... Uh, turret at range one. No extra attack die or anything. It's a secondary. I, um, I have a target lock and a focus, so let me resolve that. I'm probably uh, I've got three hits, so no reroll. All right, you've Don't got blame. an evade, so you you take a damage and uh, an yeah, ion I'm token. Dead. You're dead. Okay. I only have. I would have taken. Okay. Did you have? Okay. Yeah. I only have two one hole left. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so this goes away. This goes away. All right, um, next up is your Outrider, which is the three. Uh, who do you want to attack? Who's at the longest range? Oh, I wish my primary, I can't fire my primary weapon. Nope. This guy's at range two. This guy's at range two. This guy's at range two. Well, so I they're all at range two. Number two long. You're going to attack number two? Yeah. All right, now you get an extra attack die because of your special ability, because I'm stressed, remember? No, it only fits with primary weapons. Oh, so why'd you choose them? I don't know. I thought that a secondary would take me to Khan as the first, since the Outrider's oh. ability, but... No. Yeah, the Outrider, the Outrider just says, um, you, can you cannot perform primary weapon attacks, and you may perform secondary weapon attacks. So, yeah. we we'll have to... allows you to fire at the Right, speed. right. So, you pick some skills that you wouldn't be able to use... Because, but I mean, still, the three pilot skill is still not bad. Okay, because it's it's bigger than my one, so you get to shoot first in all cases. So you get the uh, three attack die on this guy here. Yes. Okay. So go on ahead then. I don't have any special abilities. All right, you've got I'll a blank hit crit. The, um, Your mangler cannon. You get to. Attack, you may change one hit. So you got two, crit. two crits. Now I only get two agility here because of my structural damage. So I get two defense dice and two blanks. So I take two face-up damage. Well, I'm dead You're anyway. Dead. So this guy is now dead. You got a minor hull breach. <laughs> yeah, well. All right, so this stress goes away because he's dead. Can't be stressed one. when you're dead. All right, and then this guy's left, so I get to attack you at range two. Um, range two, yeah. And then I get three attack dice. Yep. You're right at range two, so... All right, so three attack dice against how many? Two. Two, okay. All right, I've got um, crit, focus, and blank. Wait, wouldn't that? Oh, yeah, that would work. What? Against an ion. 
Kind of not this guy's ability. May treat all straight maneuvers as green maneuvers. Oh, okay. There you go. So in case you ionize me, I still get a green maneuver. Yeah, well, it's going to take me a few rounds to actually ionize you because of the large ship deal. Go ahead. How much? Oh, yeah, you don't have any. Okay, so. All right, you take one hit to your shield. You got a I, focus and a blank. So I only have four now. You have four shields left. Okay, so that concludes that, and we'll move now on to the activation phase. Okay, activation phase, starting with my one here. I'm going to go three straight ahead. That's a green maneuver. If I did one hot turn, I'd probably hit you. Maybe. I would have. To. Um, so I get to remove my stress. And for my action, I will take a target lock. Mm -hmm. Who do you think? <laughs> <laughs> on the asteroid. That's who I'm taking a target lock on. Uh -huh. Alright, your three goes next. Three slight turn. What is it? Three slight turn. Three slight turn. White maneuver for me. Alright, you end up hitting my base, so you don't get... Hit you hit. I had to move it. Okay, so... Uh, you, no action. And finally, mine is just going to be two slight turn. Like that. Okay. And for my action, I will take a... I think I'll take a target lock. All right, so that concludes movement, and now we'll move on to combat. All right, on to the uh, combat phase, starting with my five. I'm at range one with my ion turret. I get three attack dice. Two attack three. Yes, I All right, um, I'm going to spend my target lock. So you roll the other two. Uh-huh. So you just want to iron me, pretty much. I, I still want to, three, three hits. So you're going to take an ion damage. Okay, two focus. So, I wish I had a blaster turret, damn it. Alright, um, so you take an ion, that's just Please. one though, and you take one damage. So you're down to three shields. Alright, your guy gets to shoot now. You have a mangler cannon, so three I'll attack. Alright. Alright. Allows me to change a hit to a crit when ready. Alright. Go ahead. You've got two hits and a focus. To change this one. So you get two, you get a hit and a crit there. Um, I've got an evade and two focus, okay. so I take one shield hit. One, your yep. All right, I will shoot now. Um, him at range one, so I get four attack dice. Two defense for me. I have a target lock, so let me resolve that. Um, all right, so I'm going to spend my target lock to re-roll my two blanks. Crit and a focus. Alright, so I've got two crits and a hit. You've got an evade, so you take two hits. So you're down to one shield there. Still five health. Yep, good job. Alright, so I think that concludes combat. So now we'll move on to the um, activation phase again. Okay, on to the activation phase, starting with my one. It is... Stupid pin. Alright, it was a one hard turn toward you. See, I don't know if I, I'm going to hit you or not, but... Probably not. No. I'm beside you, but I'm not actually touching. I will take a target lock. Uh, your three goes next. One slight turn. One slight turn. There's one slight turn. I got it. This way or that way? That way. Okay. And what action would you like to take, good sir? I'll take a barrel. A barrel roll. All right. Flatten that out, okay. So now, I'm out of your range. Mm -hmm. I should not be in range now. That's good. And then uh, finally, my guy here is going to do a two hard turn. That's what I have on that thing. Yeah, you do. I don't think you're in range. Probably not. Okay, um, combat phase. This is going to be nice and quick, I think. Um, no firing solution, however... The iron cannon can't go that far. No. So you get to attack. Who are you going to attack? Him. Okay. Three attack die. Three attack die. You got it. Okay. I also get... Mangler. Yeah, I know. 
hit the crit. Oh, Two would... focus and a, a hit. So you get to change that to a crit. Um, I've got two focus. Wow. So I take a face up, face up damage card. Um, console fire. At the start of each combat phase, roll one attack die. On a hit result, suffer one damage. Flip this card face down as an action when I, if I use that as an action. All right. So combat phase is over. Let's, I did take some damage there. Let's see. And we'll move. You, uh, what do you mean? Probably don't have fire through. I don't. On to the uh, planning phase again. Okay, activation phase, starting with this guy here, two hard turn. It's a white maneuver. So we get out of the way. And I will take a focus. And your action, or your maneuver. One hard turn. One hard turn. This way. And what action would you like to take? I will take a... Okay, I've been getting a lot of focus lately, so I'm going to focus. Focus. Okay. I've been getting focus all lately, so. That's right. And then this guy here is going to do a two hard turn. You might not Still not, I might have range three on you, but yeah. All right, and then for my action, I will take a, am I at range two? No. So yeah, so, okay. I'll just take a fudge. Um, what? I'll take a target lock, as for what good it'll do. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I wonder, but... Yeah, right. All right. Combat phase. Um, at the start of the combat phase, I have to roll for damage um, on a hit result. Focus, so no damage. Um, you. you have to attack first. I attack first at range three. Primary weapon this time. One attack die. Three. <laughs> blank. I will re-roll. Oh, you got an evaded. Well, you should have waited. I so I'm not even going to bother now. Okay, I so mean. now you got one evade. It's fine. So no damage. And your guy now gets to shoot your mangler cannon. Three attack dice. Right, yeah. The one guy with three. And I will focus the one attack dice. Who are you attacking? This guy. Alright, so... He changes this to a hit using my focus token. And I change this to a crit. Two crits and a hit. Wow crazy. Alright, focus. Alright, so I'm going to have to take a focus. I'm going to have to spend my focus to stay in the game. Uh, that gives me... do you have? I have three. Um, immediately receive one stress token. And uh, what's this one? Man munitions failure. Immediately choose one secondary weapon. So I have three face-up damage cards. <laughs> one hall left. Wow, this guy's almost dead. Um, I'm going to have to shoot back with my guy. I'm at range... One, so I get four attack dice with that. I do have a target lock, so let me resolve that. Alright, so I have, um, alright, I'll spend my target lock to reroll this blank before I lose my target. What happened to my target lock? I did have an M on you, didn't I? Where's that other? Did I not put it on you? Oh, okay. Well, I'm going to spend my target lock anyway. Alright, and then, uh, blank. Alright, so three hits there. You got two... Two focus, so you take uh, two hits and a crit, face down, face up. Yeah. Minor hull breach, what does that do? Oh, there's a red maneuver. Oh, so a red maneuver, you have to take a damage? I have to roll. Oh, you have to roll for, what is yeah. it? Yeah. Every time, okay, so every time you make a red maneuver, you have to roll one attack die on a hit result, suffer one damage. There's a lot of uh, crits Great. going on here. All right, on to the planning phase again. Okay, activation phase, starting with my one. I'm going to have to make a one hard turn and risk it, even though it's a white maneuver. So there's that. And no action. Uh, you get to go. One hard turn. So you end up hitting my ship. All right, so you are here. Alright, so no action. And then, um, that goes with that. And then my guy here does a, a two slight turn. And, um, for my action, I'll take a focus. 
Okay, so uh, combat phase. Let me just zoom in here. Mm-hmm. Crit, so no destruction. Don't you have your iron cannon? Huh? Don't you have your iron cannon? What are you talking about? My iron. No, I was rolling for his death, remember? The console uh, fire at the start of each combat phase, roll on a hit, result suffer one damage, or roll a crit. So, uh, yeah. Alright, so... You... Okay, I attack you here. I'm surprised you don't die, so it, it is a crit, so you're the right Yeah, you think. Alright, so I have a target lock and a... Actually, I'm going to expand my target lock to... Roll, okay, so I got three focus. I'm gonna spend my focus to uh, that's three hits. Now you've got two agility, right? Yeah. Okay. Now you're gonna take an ion hit. So uh, you lose one. You get face down damage card. It's three, so I don't have two left. Uh, where's your where's that ion token at? I had it here somewhere. I think you only have one. Oh, let me get another one out of the box. Okay. So I can only go one straight, but it's a great maneuver because of his ability. Mm -hmm. Now you get to shoot back with your mango again. You have to attack him because we're touching. Because I don't want to die. All right, so you get three attack dice. I guess I'm I get two defense dice. I'm probably gonna die. No, I don't know yet. We'll see. Yeah, he's gonna have four attack dice. I only have two agility. If he gets one. No, we're touching. I can't attack you. We're we're touching each other. I cannot attack you, and you cannot no. attack me. Not until the next round, anyway. Two hits and a focus. So you're going to switch one to... I think I've got an evade. So I only take one hit, so I lose my one shield. What? I lose my shield, so it doesn't matter. Ah. Okay, so that concludes that. And now we'll move on to the activation phase again. Activation phase, starting with my one. I'm going three straight ahead. It's a green maneuver. It's the only thing I can really do. That puts me through your ship and up onto the other side. Alright, now I'm going to have to do... I'm going to take a focus for defense, I think. Yeah. And uh, to one... you're going to do a one straight ahead? It would be white, but it turns into a green because of my ability. Of um, Nian, whatever his name is. Say what now? His ability. Yeah, it, it's, it makes it a green maneuver. It makes all... Treat but all still, you weren't stressed green. in the first place, so it really doesn't matter. Now, you do get to take an action, so what action would you like to take? Target lock. On who? Hmm. Which one? Because he'll probably take it away. And if he can die, I'll, take, I'll target lock it. Okay. Because he has the iron gun. Alright. Uh, my guy is going to turn. Get away from you here. That's where it means. Mm -hmm. All right, and for my action, I will take a target lock. There. Okay, so that concludes that, and we'll move now on to the combat phase. Okay, off camera, I rolled a crit for the start of the combat phase, so no destruction, but trust me, he's gonna die, it's just a matter of time. Okay, so um, I'm gonna use my ion can or ion turret at range one there. Um, I've got two hits and a focus, so I'm gonna spend my target lock to re-roll the focus. I've got a focus, okay, of course. A focus and an evade, so you take one hit and suffer an ion. Okay, so you've got a face down, left. you have one hole left. All right, who are you going to attack? Man. You're attacking this guy here. Mangler Cannon at range one, but no special, nothing special about range one. Okay, so go ahead and roll your Mangler. I have a target lock for you. Yes, you do. You have a target lock. Crit, focus, blank. I'll change these. So you're going to do your target lock. Okay. I want to try to get all the hits I can get. Okay, go for it. Uh, hit, focus, so you get change two these. crits on me. Wow. I've got an evade, so I got a face-up damage card. Munitions failure. Immediately choose one secondary weapon and upgrade upgrade cards and discard it, then flip this card face down. So I lose my ion cannon turret. That sucks. Okay, so nothing else can happen this round. So I think we'll conclude that and move on to the planning phase again. Okay, activation phase. Starting with my one, I'm going to slight turn. 
Oh no, two hard turn rather, not straight. Or slate. Where's the two template? There it is, okay. That way? Mm hmm. And. Fudge. For my action, I think I will take a. Hmm. Depends on what you plan on doing. Alright, I'll just take a focus uh, for defense. The, okay, your guy's next. One hard turn that way. One hard turn? Should be in range. Okay. And what action do you want to take with him? I don't think a barrel would do anything. Do you mean for a turtle walk? For who? Him. Yes. I'll take a target lock. Target lock. On this, whoever this guy is. Oh, there you go. Black Sun. Black Sun. Mm hmm Finally, this guy's going to do a two hard turn. Can you really? Oh, no. I don't think you're in range. No. For my action, I will take a... Hmm. I will take a target lock. Okay. All right. Combat phase. All right. Start of the combat phase. I'm going to focus here off camera. So no death yet. Um, you get to go. Since your five is coming out of range. Phase three, you use melee cannons. You don't get an extra defense dice. Mm-hmm. Why did I grab defense dice? I don't know. Angler cannon, go for it. Kill me. Two hits and a focus. Wait, wait, wait. I think you got it. Oh, you got a target lock. You gonna spend it? Wait, where's mine? Oh. Wine, wine, yeah. Three hits, I'm dead. Triple. Alright, yeah. Three. three blanks. He is so <laughs> dead. So dead. Wait, could he be attacked? No, he cannot attack. All right, this is it. <laughs> Planning phase. Activation phase. Like Three. It's a light turn. It's hard turn. Huh? There it is. That gives me. Uh, I don't want to use a focus, so I'll use a target lock. Target lock. C. There's a D. All right, um, my turn here, activate. Four straight, it's a red maneuver. I'm going crazy. Suicide. Well, Tried I knew you were gonna go this way because you were expecting me to turn. So I figured you'd go this way and then just pick me off with your mangler. So, yeah. Now I have, t I don't get to take an action because that was- But you have to roll for damage. Roll for damage, yes. I do take a hit. You only have two hull. I have two hull left. Okay, combat phase. Combat phase, starting with the Hawk 290. Um, I'm going to use my primary weapon. I get two attack dice because of range one. I have a target lock. Um, hit a, a crit and a focus. I will spend my target lock. So if I don't roll two evades. I've got two crits. So if I need two evades, I'll be safe. Two evades. I think you'll get it. There's a lot of evades on those guys. Two blanks. I'm dead. I only have one hole left anyway. Wow. Good game. That was so close. All right, and there you have it. Another quick game for you. Hopefully you enjoyed it. That game was very close. It could have gone either way. Um, I guess I got lucky in the end. Um, I kind of knew he was going to bank behind the asteroid, so I had to sort of just sort of predict where he was going to go, and I guessed right. But had I guessed wrong, he could have used his uh, cannon and just picked me off. Because that Hawk 290 does not have much in terms of weaponry, at least primary weapon-wise. And he knocked out my freaking ion <laughs> turret. Here's a guy. Sure face. Out of all the criticals to draw, it's the one that removes the secondary. Anyway. So yeah, a good game. It was uh, excellent flying on your part. Um, if you guys want to see more gameplay, let us know. If you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel. 
and check out my official website, www.dadsgamingaddiction.com. This is Vince and Vinny Jr. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next time.